Yo, what is going on ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another video. My name is Blaze Redemption and today what I have for you guys is going to be another brand new video. In today's video guys, we're going to be giving you guys some of the best tips you guys can use for Russian in Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. Now I'm not going to lie, Russian is really, really fun in this game as it is in many other Call of Duties because it's the easiest way, the absolute easiest way for you guys to actually get a lot of kills. So first thing I have for you guys, if you're going to be Russian, you definitely want to be playing with a submachine gun. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. Submachine guns are the absolute best weapons to rush with in Call of Duty because they kill really fast and they have a very, very, very high firing rate. That's not to say that some of the assault rifles as well as other weapons in this game don't have a high firing rate, but with rushing with a submachine gun, you have a much better chance of actually winning a gunfight. So, if you guys actually need a class setup for a submachine gun, I do have a few um, class setups on my channel with, I think, every submachine gun in the game. I don't think I've missed any submachine gun. I don't think I've actually missed any submachine guns. If, and if I did miss one, the gameplay is going to be coming soon. But all the best submachine guns, there's already gameplays up on the channel. So if you guys need a class set up with a submachine gun, go ahead and go check out one of the ones I have on my channel. There's one of them playing with right now. It's one of my favorite class setups. Honestly, probably my favorite weapon in the game. The AK-74U is really good. It's very overpowered. It has a really good accuracy, a nice high firing rate, and good damage where you can literally pick off enemies at pretty much any range if we have a good accuracy so first things first jumping into these tips like I say in every video your class setup is the most important you guys want to have a class setup that uh, has a stem shot so you guys can get your health back faster a class setup that has some type of lethal that you can actually throw fast like a grenade or a c4 and you want to be running stuff like um, the that, well, all right. So when you when I'm rushing in this game, what well, really it, with all of my class setups, this game you die a whole lot to um, frag grenades or like any type of explosives, and you guys actually uh, die a lot to the um, to like stun grenades and flash grenades. So I like to run perk greed because it's gonna allow me to actually put on multiple perks from each class. Um, my perks that I like to run with perk greed, I put on flag jacket and tack mask. I have scavenger because when you're rushing, you tend to run out of bullets fast, especially if you're actually getting a lot of kills. And I also run quartermaster because it allows me to resupply my lethal equipment, which helps me get even more kills, especially on people who like to camp. And then I also run with gung ho because the gung ho allows you to actually shoot hip fire while running and then like sprint and hip fire at the same time it also allows you to um continue to shoot while um using your equipment or while throwing equipment if i'm not mistaken i'm not really too sure on that last part about the throwing equipment but while you're using equipment you can still shoot so it's pretty helpful and then it also reduces your falling damage so if you got the hip and jump out a window or something like that while somebody's shooting at you to stay alive it definitely helps and then i also like to run the um spycraft because with spycraft uh, when people put down jammers then i can still see them through my jammer like if i have an advanced uav or uav up or if i have a field mic near i can still see them and then also whenever people throw up counter uavs it doesn't block my radar and i can hack people's equipment so all of this stuff right there is really really helpful for rushing in the game now the next thing i have for you guys is going to be rush routes if you guys notice in today's gameplay i'm like literally running the same way every single time like you got to find a route that you guys can run to that you know you're not getting shot from but in the same time you're actually still in line with a whole bunch of enemies so you can get a bunch of kills so whenever i rush i try to rush rush through flanks and try to get behind my enemies so i can actually get easier kills shooting them in the back or where I can like have the upper advantage and catch them off of their spawn or something like that. Your score streaks definitely play a big role with rushing because the UAV and the advanced UAV is going to allow you to see where the enemy is going to be at. And then like stuff like the war machine is going to give you uh, the firepower capability uh, to kill the whole entire team. Stuff like body armor is going to help you with staying alive because you can literally get double 
health with the body armor and then like there's many other score streaks in this game that you guys can use but as always those are pretty much my score streak group that i actually like to use in this game because it's just really helpful for me with staying alive and getting a lot of kills but um find your rush routes find routes where like i said you can go to without dying um pay attention to your mini map your mini map awareness is very very detrimental for rushing because a lot of enemies especially whenever your teammates are flipping the spawns consistently they spawn very fast and they will spawn right on top of you especially like, like i say if you rush into the back of the spawn and say like you killed everybody on the enemy team or you killed majority of everybody and no one else is spawning if your teammates push through to the to the opposite spawn of where you're at they're all spawn on you so just be aware of your map and that's another reason why i like to run the field mic because it's gonna allow me to see those people who are running around my field mic so with that being said um those are pretty much my tips and tricks for how to rush in the game like i said guys make sure you guys are actually using a submachine gun this helps so so much i'm sorry for hitting my mic it helps so so much for staying alive that stem shot is going to help you stay alive so much and it's going to increase your capability of getting multi kills in the game and then like i said man the c4 you can blow up enemies those score streets they play a big role everything ties into one so if you guys haven't already checked out my other tips and tricks or best class setups go ahead and go check that out on the channel as well as drop a like on today's video if these tips help you in any way shape form or fashion or if you guys actually enjoyed the gameplay or commentary or anything like that feel free to subscribe you guys are brand new to the channel and you guys have not already there's literally 69 percent of you guys who are watching these videos who are not subscribed to the channel it helps out the channel so much man i've been grinding i am literally tired this is my third video that i'm uploading today on schedule so i can actually keep uploading videos every single day man you guys gotta understand the grind i know i've been inconsistent in the past and i know in the past i probably said that i'm gonna come back to youtube but i'm so serious this time i am so serious this time ladies and gentlemen i have my own space i got really good internet i have a consistent job where i'm working the same hours so i can very easily manage my time especially on my off days i can just consistently pump out videos as you guys can tell i'm getting gameplays left and right man look i'm actually having fun with this game I don't know about you guys, but I'm actually having fun with this game. But like I said, man, hope you guys did enjoy today's video. I'm going to leave you guys with the live commentary. I was actually chilling with one of my homies. One or two of my homies in the Discord. I can't remember. I know for sure one of my homies. He actually let me play on his account to get this gameplay. But yeah, man. Thanks you guys so much for watching once again, man. Don't forget to drop a like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy Blaze Redemption. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Bro, I'm just trying to understand. First of all, how that nigga knew I was there? Second of all, how the fuck did he one melee in me? Third of all, why the fuck didn't my teammate shoot at the nigga who wearing straight past his fucking screen? Dude, this nigga sniped me again, bro. This nigga is always hard scoping.
Losing B. Hitting the nuke ain't the hard point, bro. The capitalists will remember this. Nigga, that was. Getting the nuke ain't the hard point, bro. Hundred twenty-one and eight. Ain't the hard part, trust me when I tell you. <laughs> I could have had a triple nuke this game and man keep choking. Ding 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 ding.